Woke up this morning, think I'm out in those summer days. Best friend got caught up when I stayed in Douglasville. What's good, y'all? So, this, what I read, I just woke up, honestly. What I read really frustrated me. Young Thug says, look, he'd had J. Cole level talent, but will hide it to fit into rap landscape. So, that means to tell me he had a lot of potential. In certain areas. But was scared to say anything. Or scared to do anything. Because he was like yo. Well Young Thug said I had this level of talent right. Okay. Bet. But he told me. If you try to be this way. People not gonna rock with you as much. Now music might bop. But people ain't gonna buy your stuff as much. Your stuff ain't gonna be played in the club as much. You might not have a lot more, a lot of deals at start until you build a good following. Are you ready for that? My boy may say yes, but no, because some people come from where he came from. You know what I'm saying? In Cle Cleveland Avenue or something like that. Cleveland Avenue. Like I used to meet my ex out there to you know hang out and not like at there, but that's like a middle spot from Locust Grove and that spot and then from there you know we go to Locust Grove. But still, I know that area. It's not really popping. It's not popping. It's like nah. It's honestly not. Drove down that road. It it's cool, but mm, it, it's okay. So I get why he's like, yo, I need to get my mama out of here. I need to get my family out of here. I get it. Personally, I get it. When you come from nothing or when you come from a struggling family financially, you want to do any means necessary to get your family out of that situation. But, like I said, it sucks that look he had that amount, that amount of talent but didn't fully show it. Soon, sooner. And it sucks that Young Thug didn't like fully say you're not gonna make all the money, but here's all the money. Here, here's you go. Cause I, I get it. Business wise, that would be smart. You know, like you have to invest in people that know that you can make a return. Cause if not, now you losing money. But is it a good investment or not? I don't know. I just know Lil Key passed away, and that sucks. Um. Yeah. That sucks. I pray the rap game forces itself to evolve the way it used to be, he said. It needs to be real rap. This young man, look, he, mine is so caught up into what you must dish out to where you want to get, um, to where you want to go, to the point where you he hides his true talent. His true talent is like J. Cole, but he hides it. He hides that because he knows that the old thug is gone. Get him the millions of dollars. Mm. I'm sorry, just reading to people, I don't do that. I, I read by myself. I personally don't read like that, trust me. Um, Let's watch this right quick. My oldest, my son, Key, I pray that. The rap game forces itself to evolve the way it used to be. Like it need to be the way it used to be. It needs to be real rap. It don't need to be play play rap. And the reason why I say that is because he's this young man. Mine is so caught up into what you must dish out to get where you got to go to the point where he had his true talent. His true talent is like J Cole, but he had that because he know he know that. The way he are, the old thug, it's going to give him the millions of dollars. So I pray to God that the game get back how it used to be. So it could be how it need to be. It's crazy. We got to, we promote violence and drugs, and that's what get us the millions. But if we do a J. Cole or Kendrick Lamar verse, 90% of the world going to look over it. Nipsey, 90% of the world looked over him. I don't want that to be him. Hmm. Do you hear what he just said?
that's that's sad, man. It's sad because Young Thug, a dude that we all know, rapped about certain things. No people like Future that rapped about certain things. Telling him like, yo, this not the way to go. We need to change the game. You thinking you could rap about the old thug that you used to be? Mm -mm. You can't do that. I, I get where he's coming from. I get what he's saying. Let's see what this video is about. We also got to mention he's not. I don't think he's here. Little Key, right? My son. Talk about talk about Little Key. You call him your son. That's why you call him his, your son. And like, what, what what's so, what's so special about that young man? Because I had my, when I had my first son. Me and my baby mom was together. I'm like, man, go. We, we just hated each other. My mom loved my son so much. Mm. I seen a different type of love from my mom and my first son. Yeah. And then I seen a different type of love from my mom and Key. My mom turned me on him. My mm. mom called me like, yo, it's a kid named Key. You need to get him. Oh, your mom did? Okay. Yes. He was already wow. hanging with my, he young. He was already hanging with my nephews. He was hanging with my nephews every day, but my nephew never said nothing to me about it. Mm. And it hurts. And it, and it's sad. You know what I'm saying? Folks out here with so much talent, but they hide it so they can make millions. And it hurts because I now sometimes I be like, should I hide my talent and just stay ignorant? Should I, should I, should I just stop trying to rap? Should I just rap about... Kids popping drugs. I could go the future route. Future never. He he had. He went to college. Let's say that he went same high school my dad went to and went to college. So I'm like, yo. Do I need to go the future route? Do I just need to make some ignorant album, pop? No offense, future, but I'm just saying. I know a few dudes that just get high, and listen to your music all day. I bet you change. I bet you involved in the game, but you got music. You got albums out there that literally got people smoking, got people drinking, got people doing certain type of things to grieve the loss of a family member, grieve a loss of a friend. Besides getting actual help, going to someone to talk to, they rather turn to liquor bottle. They'd rather turn to lean, molly, pills, all types of pills and shit. Like, it's sad. It's a very sad rap world we live in. Very sad. Um, look, he, he, had, he had a lot of talent. I heard some of his music. Like I said, my homie... You know, Cole played me some of his music. He said, yeah, bro, little key, he passed away. Da -da -da. Here, listen to this. I said, yo, I see what he's talking about. I see what Young Thug just now, while I'm talking to y'all, is talking about. I don't know, it just, this really messes with me. Because I think about myself in situations like this. But rest in peace, look Heed, and I hope Young Thug gets out of jail sometime soon. Peace. I hope y'all enjoyed this. You know, I'm I'm still trying to be good at narrating, you know what I'm saying? Reading to y'all. So y'all can be like, okay, cool, cool. All right, all right, I get what you're saying, you know? Peace. Sorry, y'all the poet.